We'll fight in Yemen now. They were never been Bruce Lee. Yeah, but fought Bruce Lee, they were never been a cheeky dog. <laughs> Now, what is this, uh, what is this thing you do? In Cantonese, Jeet Kune Do, the way of the intercepting fist. Intercepting fist, huh? Or foot. Come on, touch me. Any way you can. You see? To reach me, you must move to me. Your attack offers me an opportunity to intercept you. In this case, I'm using my longest weapon, my sidekick, against the nearest target, your kneecap. This can be compared to your left jab in boxing, except it's much more damaging. I see. Well, speaking of a left jab... Oh! This time I intercept your emotional tenseness. You see, from your thought to your fist, how much time was lost. Not much. Yeah. Move, move. No, no, no. no. Don't just move for the sake of moving. Relate to me. Relationship. Relationship. You're aware. Aware. Adjust. Now open it up a little bit. Feel the wind blowing. Ah, the bird. You hear the bird chirping? Yes. Oh. Open it up. Take with it. Ah, oh, yes! Now, how did it feel to you? Like, I didn't kick, it kicked. Terrific! Now, what? What is the highest technique you hope to achieve? To have no technique. Very good. What are your thoughts when facing an opponent? There is no opponent. And why is that? Because the word I does not exist. So, continue. A good fight should be like a small play, but played seriously. A good martial artist does not become tense, but ready. Not thinking, yet not dreaming. Ready for whatever may come. When the opponent expands, I contract. When he contracts, I expand. And when there is an opportunity, I do not hit. It hits all by itself. Or oh, don't hit back.
为可能太等着，甚至装你的什么冷笑着，添加谁的理由如何？只敢跟我背上你的，我的，却叫了的，却那个独占寻觅一个，成功难测。